Hello, everybody. We're going to be playing on Times 10 servers. One of my favorite servers is this one. It's really. There are annoying things about Times 10 servers, but there's also some pretty fun ones. The very fun one with Demo is using the Charge of Charge because you're practically immune to soldiers and you're immune to Pyros. Nothing can hurt you. It's hilarious. And people rage out this so much. But it's really just it's hilarious. Also, as you can see, the guy in front of me is using the biker's bazooka. You're getting 30 rockets, and it's insanely impossible. But even the charge and charge takes barely any damage against The only thing that can honestly kill you is heavies, scouts, and snipers, because you can pretty much kill anything else. As you can see, I'm really lagging badly. This happens a lot of times in servers because, well, people with the beggars, 30 missiles, never, just never is gonna end well. Also, a very cheap thing to use in these servers are gunslingers. And it's weird, but you, it's, it's an engineer with 425 health. And you, your main sentries barely die at all. They're impossible to kill, I swear. I've shot one with a direct hit. I don't even know how many times. And they've never died. As you can see, I'm lagging so badly I can't even move. It's really just annoying me right now. Whatever. You get to, sorry, you have to hear me talk. Wait, Spies are fun if you're using just the plain out stock. It's hilarious you're using it. Because you have it. Basically, you're, you're stabbing so fast, you're guaranteed to get a back stab. Like just, or a face stab. If you're not aware what a face stab is, it's when someone, you, your knife glitches through someone's face and counts as a back stab. People hate it, but it's part of TF2. Get over. Still really lagging right here. Nice spells, dude. Um, atomizers are very fun. Make sure you have a pretty boy's pocket pistol with you because you're going. By the time you're done jumping, you, you're gonna have 10 health left. You get to jump 10 times without doing anything. Pyro stocks are pretty fun because you get a ton. You can air blast them crazily fast. It's fun, especially if someone's trying to shoot you with a beggar's bazooka, because then you can. Ref they get really annoyed when you foot 30 missiles, but it's just the reality of that. I'm still lagging really badly. These guys, I'm not sure what's going on. Right now. Well, I'm gonna go quit and rejoin. So you guys get to hear me rant a lot. A lot of the things that are pretty good, let's see here. The splendid screen, very annoying because one hit basically kills heavies. I've charged a heavy and killed him without swinging. It's pretty funny. They get mad about that too. Uh, Natasha's are pretty fun because you're getting health each hit. It's really hard to kill you. I I've been using this for sometimes I play heavy on time sense servers, but every time this kills me. Blast Beasts get 200% damage bonus, they kill pretty much everything. Sand sandwiches, you get 10. Is there any way to complain about 10 sandwiches? I mean, who doesn't love those? You actually notice suck, but they're very fun just to watch the animation of you swinging really insanely fast. It's pretty funny actually. Sorry that I'm kind of, I don't have hats for some of them, so I'm using that. So, pretty, another pretty good thing is we have the Huntsman, which I'm not sure why, but they give you 125 ammo. It's pretty fun, but I mean, who doesn't want that much ammo? Razorbacks are insanely fun because 
you get to block 10 back steps. Not exactly sure what the Kikiri does, but uh, in sort of one shots a couple things. Dead ringers are very fun on tap sense servers because the second you feign your death, you pretty much get it back. It, you, it drains really quickly, but it takes like three seconds to build it back up. So that's pretty fun. Uh, these one shot a lot of things and they go insanely fast. Although you have to be really dead on with this because as you see, 70% explosion radius. So you get nothing. This they pretty much just glitched out because you get unlimited ammo on this thing. It's pretty fun, but so you have unlimited ammo and it's really fun. Trying to find these overheal you a ton. These are fun. Although I hate that all of them because sometimes it takes a while to get a kill. Reserve shooters, you get one shot. Whoopee. Um, these are fun if you have a beggars because then you can load up all three rockets, shoot at your feet, go super high, and not take any damage except fall damage. I don't have much for scout, but this gives you 425 health. Also very fun. This gives you 10 baseballs. But although you, you it still gives you 115 health because they had to take away the boost because they couldn't just make it where you had no health. This does nothing at all. No point in using it. Don't even bother. Although this does, I forgot to mention this. This they made this um attack speed go down. I'm trying to remember. There's another thing that I hated on time centuries. This does no damage whatsoever. It's annoying, but you go insanely fast. Uh, I don't have it, but if you have a blood starter, do not use it on time sensors. It is annoying as hell. I swear. You just you lose 20, 20 health every single second. It's annoying. So basically, just imagine you losing health every 20 seconds. It's annoying. Every second. Can't think straight right now. Vaccinators are fun because they build up their uber like insanely fast. Mediguns, I, I don't play medic much, so I'm not sure what the medigun does. I know for a fact that this thing, one hit will um, make your uber go all the way up. It's You have to wait five seconds after every swing, though. That's the downside about that. Everything has downsides, but it's hard to look fast sometimes. I know this shoots a ton at a time. I think it may I think they made the grenade launch for rapid fire. I'm not exactly sure, but I think they did. This gives this is fun because it go, has a damage bonus, so one shot so a lot of things. It's projectiles go insanely fast. Although if you hit yourself it sucks. Because as you see it's plus twenty five damage to self to you're doing 250 percent damage to yourself. Not fun at all. You have you have one shot with this too. Per clip, you have one shot. It's annoying. So, as you know, this would give you, this gives you 425 health as demo. It's pretty fun, but and also if you're charging, it gives you insanely good um turning. It gives you a little bit slower turning than a regular turn, but it's still fun to turn that fast at mid charge. Who doesn't want to do that? I think I've covered about everything. Let me check. Oh yeah, you get a ton of crits with this. I think you get like a hundred crits with these if they sap your sentry. Clip size is one. I still I don't know what some of these do because I don't play these classes that much. Um, I'm not sure I went to the construction PDA, but well, I think that's about it. Um, didn't go into the rest of the pile. This does pretty much no damage against 50% against non burning players. No point in doing it if you're not going to catch people on fire. Home does nothing to players. It 
one shots pretty much every building except many centuries, which I hate. I'm just annoying as heck. Um, I'm trying to remember if there's anything else. I'm sorry if it's taking so long, but it takes a while for me to learn this stuff. Uh, I'm not sure what this does. I think it does what the stock does and just makes you swing faster. I'm not sure. Because, what, what is it going to do? Flame you 10 times? Also, this builds up very fast. Like, literally, you can get done with it, and second later it'll be ready to go. It recharges even faster than the dead ring move. So, you're getting for that. I'm not sure what this watch does. I don't use stock that much, except for pyro, soldiers, shotgun. You know, any other class I have stock with, I'll probably not play with. This, I don't play with it. I'm not a fan of spies anymore, just because of the trouble things. Mainly the problem with pyros, because free to play, play pyros so much, there's so many pyros everywhere, I swear. Name one time you have not been on a team where there hasn't been three pyros or three scouts. I guarantee you, it's happened to everybody. It always happens. You just know it's going to happen now. Well, I guess we got a little time left, so I'm going to see if I can rejoin the times 10 server. Hopefully I'm not going to be lying this time. There we go. As you can see, we're going to a different map. This one, I know exactly what I want to do. But first, I have to go test from something, because I don't have it. I need to go test from the Ammonizer, so I can go jump, because I know this map pretty well. It's basically, it's going to be two things. It's like two giant, two giant offering things that you're trying to get the intel for. I am either going to be playing scout for this because I need, I want to test run the organizer. So give me a second. So give me shop real quick. Hurry up, computer. There we go. I just need to look for it real quick. Sorry if it's taking a while. So, also, if you guys have any other complaints about what happens with free plays, like what they do, if it's annoying you or something, well, actually, let's, let's get this instead, just because of how fun this thing is. Just watch what happens with the winner. I, I completely forgot to tell you guys about this. This you just have to see to believe. That's hilarious. As you know, they buffed it a little bit. So, it gives you 25% jump height, right? So now, you get 250% jump height. So, as you can see, we're on this giant thing with our missiles. See if I can jump over the other side. See if my friend's on still. Nope. I'm not sure why that didn't work. Yeah, see, I died because I touched the ground. I'm not sure what happened right there because I'm pretty sure I had that equipped. I'm not sure what happened. Did they like fix that or something? I think they did fix that. That that sucks for me. Um. No, screw that over. Well, tell me what you guys want me to play next time. I play a lot of these classes. Just please do not ask me to play medic or pyro or scout. Well, not scout. Eh, medic, medic, pyro or spy. You will literally watch me fail completely if you want me to play those. I suck with those classes. I hate them. I'm sorry if they're your favorite class, but I just don't like them. I am decent spy, but I don't like playing it just because I hate out being stealthy. I just like running straight at people and killing them. It's fun for me. I'd rather do that than hide behind them. Because also, there's so many spy checkers nowadays just because of how many free plays play spies too. 
we have to mention that. It's pretty first place spy a lot too. They're always spamming spies, pyros, and scouts all the time. Personally, I feel like you should never have more than two pyros or more than two scouts. You should never have two more than two classes unless it's either one an NG, two a medic, because every team needs a medic. So if you notice there's three scouts on your team already, please don't go scout. Go medic. Every team needs a medic. Your heavy will be grateful, your soldier will be grateful, maybe even your demo. I hope you enjoyed this video of just me talking randomly, but I guess you guys never really got to see any of the actual stuff, so I'll do a times 10 actual gameplay next time. Hopefully I won't be lagging at all. Doubtful, but I hope he's on the team. So type in the comments what what sets what what weapons you want me to use. What the hell? Oh. Um, tell me what weapons you guys want me to use, and what other things you want me to use. You know, if you saw any other weapons that you would like me to try out for this, so you could see what they would do, just type in the comments below. I'll get to them eventually. I'll try to look at every comments, but once if I get more popular, it's gonna be harder and harder. But I'll just stick with doing as much as possible right now. But Hope you guys like my video. Please subscribe. But crap, I will die again. Yeah, I did. Well, see you guys next time. I'll try to post again when I can. Please leave in the comments if you want me to change what I'm doing at all. If you what weapons you want me to use. If there's anything you want me to now. If there's a certain server you want me to go on, feel free to leave in the comments. I will check it out eventually.